Hello? Yala. Yala. Yes, my friend, you keep hanging up. I'm not the one who did not call you. I mean, here we go. Go ahead. What do you want to say to us? My internet was very bad. Okay, what I can I'm do, honest. my friend, did you say inshallah before you call me? You should say inshallah because if you don't say inshallah, there's a there's a prophet who had want to have sex with 99 women, but he forgot to have to say inshallah. So Allah, he mm -hmm. gave him a half a child. Do you know the story? Yes. Okay, why is that? Why Allah, he uh -oh. gave him nine, nine, uh, he gave him half a child. He forgot to say um, inshallah. Um, uh, um, Solomon, Solomon. Al-Hadith, Ta'if. Ta'if? It's Ta'if, no. but this is a story in the Quran, my friend. La. Uh -huh. uh, shuf. Shunu Shuf. Don't you? Listen, here we go. It says a chapter 38, verse number 23, that my brother, he have 99 goats. Uh, al Quran. This in the Quran. Uh, show me. Show you. I'm showing you. Here we go. I said, just told <laughs> you. Chapter 38, verse number 23. Okay. Hmm. Chapter. <clears throat> chapter 32. 38, verse number 23. Okay. Hmm. Opening now. All right. That's wonderful. Uh, in, um, internet uh, very bad very bad very, very bad, bad. Mm -hmm. yeah okay um uh, you you speak uh, arabic no i speak german option oh uh, you said you said you you are arab my friend answer i just gave you a question what does have to do uh, yes i'm an arab yes uh, so how come uh, you don't speak uh, Arabic? Hey, I was, uh, you know, uh, I was in the like plane with the kids and somebody hit me in my head. Like what happened to your prophet? He lost his four teeth in the front. So I lost my front teeth and I lost my memory. Now, what about you? Do you speak Arabic? Uh, sure, yeah. Sure, yeah. So what you say to me when you debate me in Arabic if you don't speak Arabic? Um, um, I speak um, classical Arabic. Uh, very good. Uh, okay, now. What do you say about what we see in the front of us that this prophet he's saying he is calling his wives as goats and he want to have sex with all of them so they will have children and he will do jihad i'm read i'm reading uh, verse 48 to 23 uh, read correct? Verse. yeah read verse okay uh, yeah. oh. it, uh indeed uh, this my brother has uh, 99 uh, wheels and I have one wheel so he said in trust uh, mm. what has this to do what I'm asking you this 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 this, 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 this not relevant this is not I relevant, why, not relevant. Why, why not relevant you said to me that this hadith is weak but this is uh, this as I know this is not weak this is Quran first of all chapter 48 verse 23 uh-huh is that a, is, uh, you said to me this is weak where you? Where, who told you that this is weak? But what is this? The, indeed, this my brother has ninety. Okay, women. so he, this guy, he want to have sex with ninety nine women, one hundred women, less one, and he want to make them have babies so he can do jihad. And here we go. This is the hadith. This is a daif hadith. What do you think? It's daif hadith. What do you think? It says that the son Solomon's sons, the prophet the, the, or the prophet David, said. Tonight, I will go around and I will have boom boom with the 100 women of my wives, every one of them whom will deliver a male child. So I will do jihad for the cause of Allah. But he forgot to say, he will get says, and on that the angel said to him, say, if Allah will. But Solomon yeah, yeah. did not say yeah. if it is, he did not say it. Not. So Allah, he gave him half a child. Explain to me the story. This is the Eif hadith. Uh, Ismail Habibi. Hmm. Uh, what hadith? The word. Uh, darling, uh, the, the, the word there for wives is Naja. Naja, 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 mean Naja mean goat. Yes, but it not mean it, it doesn't mean wives mm. in Arabic. So the you word? are saying that Solomon he was having sex with goats? 
it, that means uh, you it doesn't mean uh, the, the word for uh, wife is listen so are you saying that Solomon was having sex with goats not with wives because you say this is not wives but in Arabic it says Naja Naja mean what goats so are you saying that he was having sex with goats my friend it, it, it is a language of Arabic that you don't understand well, at that time they call their wife a goat how many goat you have at home? No, wait. It, it doesn't uh, it say um, that he had sex. Uh -huh. uh, okay. It says he entrusted her. Look. Listen, listen. Okay, this is. Uh, uh, let me show you the hadith, my friend. The hadith said the hadith, the hadith. Okay, the hadith. Let me show you here the hadith. It said that he said I'm going to have sexual intercourse with them. Read with me carefully. Do you see my screen? No. Okay. It says the prophet Solomon, the son of the prophet David, it said, no problem. I'm reading for you. Listen, I'm reading. So he said, Wait. tonight I will go around, i.e., have boom boom sexual intercourse with 100 women of my wives, every one of whom will deliver a male child. The angel said to him, say, inshallah, if Allah will. But Solomon did not say that. He forgot to say it. Then when he had boom boom sexual intercourse with his wives, none of them deliver any child except one. She gave him a half person. What does that mean? Mm. Go ahead. Well, uh, you, you got to look at uh, the, the the narration. Ah, what, what is the chain the of the narration? Okay. And what is that? What does that mean? This is this is this is a daif hadith. This is daif. I'm I'm not saying that. Uh, no, you said that already. You told me it's daif. You forgot. You have a short memory, my friend. Hit your head again. You said to me this is because, daif. Because the chain of the okay, so uh, narrator. So this is daif. This is daif. Yes or no? Uh, yes. Okay, but this is Sahih Bukhari. Oh, you can say that, but uh, you have to prove. <laughs> Sahih Bukhari is daif now. Sahih Bukhari is daif. I don't uh, see uh, your screen. Uh, here we go. I will give you the link. No problem. This is Sahih Bukhari. Internet is hadith bad. Hadith number, no problem. Sahih Bukhari, hadith number 5242. I'm calling you from uh, my phone. Uh, not I from, don't care, uh, William. No problem. I will give you the link. Here we go. I will give you the link. No problem. Okay. Don't okay. forget Let to me... say inshallah before you open it because it's not going to open if you don't say inshallah. Uh, you Look are what happened to Suleiman. He have sex with 99 women and then Allah deliver him half a child. What does that mean, half child? Do you know what half child means? Yeah. What does that mean, half child? Uh, uh, pre, uh, pre, pre, premature. Premature. So is Allah punishing uh -huh. Suleiman, giving him half a child? No, no premature. Read, read the Arabic. Do you understand Arabic? Yeah. Okay. Open the link. I gave you the link in Arabic and read it for us. Let us see if you read Arabic. Go ahead. Let me go. I did not receive anything. No, I gave you a link, my friend. Don't tell me you did not. Click at the chat. <coughs> uh, <laughs> what, 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 what? What? I say again? What? 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 Say again? What? What, what is the first word? Um, Hadutani. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Let me read it for you. Okay, I will help you. No problem. You don't know Arabic. Don't lie next time. Say you speak Arabic. Hadathana Mahmudun. Hadathana Abdul Razaqi. Akhbarana Muammar. An Ibn Tawus. Do you know Ibn Tawus? Tawus is your yeah, cousin. Yeah, Tawus, exactly. Are what you not Tawus? Ah, Ibn Tawus is your cousin. What Tawus mean? Tell me. You claim to speak Arabic. Well, Tawus is a bird, have many colors in his wings. Are you serious? I'm very serious. Go, go, go to the Arabic dictionary. Here we go. I will just search in Google, and you will see that the word Taos will show you the bird. Here we go. Do you see it? Okay. This is ah, Taos. Let's open your channel. I don't see it. This is the Taos. Let me try. Uh... Are you Give serious? Me one I'm opening your uh, YouTube channel. Ah, okay. One second. Uh -huh. uh, you know, internet here uh, yeah, very I mean, bad. I understand the internet is very bad. 
Islam is da'if, Hadith is da'if, Quran is da'if, Internet is da'if, anything the Muslim touch is da'if. Yeah, Israel is strong. Okay. Okay, I see. Now I see. I see bird. Hmm. This is the bird. Uh, this is Tawus. You said to me, are you serious? Uh, you my friend, copy the word, put it in dictionary. Let us everybody see what the word means. Okay, here we go. So I will copy the word. I will put it for you in dictionary. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. In front of my eyes. In the front of your eyes, no problem. Here we go. Just wait. Hold on. Let me open the dictionary side. Mm -hmm. All right. Internet is very bad here. The internet is very bad, for sure, very bad. Very okay. hot in all sides. Okay, here we go. This is the this is the this is the dictionary, and I will put the word Taus. Mm -hmm. It's a name of a bird. Here we go. Do you see it? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Mm. So. Yeah. What, what it, it means. Uh, Yes, but you know, Arabic uh, can mean many different things. It can mean many different things. Uh -huh. You know, my friend, I want to learn. Ar okay, what is the other meaning for the word Taos? I'm listening. Uh, we, we use the ta Taos for, you know, for many different birds. Not okay, give me, give me, no, give me what other meaning for Taos? We showed you that Taos is a name of a bird. Now, what is that? Huh? Mm -hmm. It can also mean uh, hills. Hills? You no know, hills. Hills yeah. mean Taos? No, 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 no. Hills for women. You know, women when uh, they were uh, hills. Really? Me. Yes. <laughs> My friend, aren't you the one who says to me, show me dictionary? Yes, Taos mean. Okay, mean well, this is the dictionary. The dictionary says this is what it means. Read, read carefully. Hmm? This is what dictionary is saying, and not me. Internet is very bad. Ah, cannot... Okay, my friend, let's, let's go to the topic. So, Suleiman, obviously, you don't you do not know what are you talking about. So, Su Suleiman, Suleiman, he wanted to have sex with ninety nine women, who the Quran described them as goats, and then he forgot to say the word inshallah. and then Allah he gave him a half a child. Why this is happening to Suleiman? Well, because they forgot to say uh, inshallah. Well, uh, Christian men, all men, the Hindus, the Buddhas, they don't say Allah at all when they have sex, and they don't say Allah at all unless they want to laugh at something comedy. So how come yes. they have a full child, but the one who is a prophet of Allah, he forgot to say, inshallah, Allah gave him half a child. Because he was um, ignorant. You know? Ah, he was ignorant. So, are you saying because you are ignorant, Allah will punish your son? He will make him half son. What is the fault of this little baby? You did nothing wrong. Allah is punishing yeah, Suleiman yeah. or punishing the baby now? You know, because you you have to obey him. If you don't obey him, you know there's so obey him what? So, if I don't obey Allah, Allah will make you have a half son. Not not half. The word there mm. is premature. What a what premature? Is premature? Where it says here in Arabic, Arabic it says nusfu insan. It doesn't say premature. Nus, not the word nusf in Arabic mean half. Yeah, premature. But it no, it says nusf. Premature. It doesn't say premature. It says nusf half a human. This is what mm. nusf mean. Nusf mean half. Now, let us say it's premature, as you said. Okay, I don't say inshallah at all. I am against mm -hmm. the will of Allah and there's millions and hundreds of millions of people like me But they have you know, I'm not married so I cannot speak about myself But they have kids and their kids is not half a child as the as as the story tell Actually, you're a prophet father himself. He was not a Muslim, correct? Yeah, okay, so how Muhammad is not a half a human being the father of Muhammad He was not a Muslim. He did not say inshallah. So Muhammad was a half man and half donkey or one a full human? Uh, I want to ask you something. Ask me something, but why you don't answer about this before you ask me something? You can ask me a lot of something. I will, I will answer, I will answer you one huh. second. Uh, you said uh, in many of your videos about uh, we will, the world, we, we Don't change the topic. Answer me about this something, and then you can ask me about the other something. No, 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 we go back. We go back to... No the, problem. You can go back thing. later. We want, why would I go back if you can tell me right now? Tell me. Muhammad's father, he did not say, inshallah, before he have sex with his mother. 
So why Muhammad is not a half a how human? Do you know? Huh? How do you know? Because Muhammad, he says his, his father will go to hell. He is not a believer. Where? Where? Is this? Uh, I, is saw this uh, I saw claim? it in the. I saw it in the magazine. Is this your claim or my claim? Mm. Yeah. What do you think? Why would my claim? Well, your claim is your claim. It doesn't mean that is the truth. Okay, but if, what if I approve it? You cannot. I cannot. Are you sure? <laughs> well, let's see. No, I'm saying, what if I claim it? What what will happen? You have to show it to me from a. If if you show to me from Sahih uh, source, you mm. shut me up. If you show me from Sahih source, if you show me from Daif or Hassan, mm. you know, not acceptable. Mm. Okay, oh, here we go. The hate in front of us. What you will what you will say? Yeah, send it to me on Skype. I don't see your channel. Give me two seconds. I'll open. It is the, the problem is Daif. But well, the problem is Daif. What we will do now is Daif. It says a man asks, "Where is my father?" Messenger of Allah said, "Your father uh -huh. in hell." When he turned his back, he said, the prophet, my father and your father in hell. But is Daif what he can do now? Do you think this is rejected now? Of course. Okay, of course, but, it is, but, but of course, but it is sahih. But it is sahih. What we would do now? Where, where does it say sahih? It says sahih there. Where? It says there. I don't send it to me on Skype. Okay, I will send it to you on Skype. I can go back to the to other topic. Yeah, we are in the topic. So you said to me, the prophet, no, no, no. this is the topic. I mean, either, either, either you agree, either you agree that the story you are giving me is a stupid, or you agree this, that this this Muhammad is a, is a liar. Al Albani. Is it Sahih or not? It's Al Albani. What Al Albani? This is first of all, this is Sunan Abi Dawood. The whole book is authentic. It is authentic book. The books of Sahih are six, and this is your Muslim website. And the grade of it, said, said it is Sahih. Who said? Who said it's Sahih? I said that because I learned that from universities. Do you have an Islamic degree? No, no. I do. So the books of Sahih are six, and one of them is Sunan Abi Dawood. No, I know, I know. Okay, no, you do not know. Don't tell me you know. You know nothing. Now answer. So you're a prophet, father. He's, he's in hell because he's not a believer. So he did not say, inshallah. Now we go back to zero. So why Suleiman? Uh, because he did not have, did not say, inshallah. Allah, he gave him half a child. What happened? Wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> it says, a man is to what is my father, messenger. But th this is not a prophet talking. No, the prophet talking. But a man asked, to hey, the man he asked the prophet and the man he got he's gone so Muhammad he says to him because yeah, he, he gets upset oh my god the dub listen huh he says uh, just read read English okay read. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. a man asked uh -huh. a man yes uh -huh. where is my father uh -huh. messenger of Allah okay. so a man asked the messenger uh -huh. and the messenger said your mm -hmm. father is in hell so he's not talking about his father he's talking about the father of the man mm. But he said, you understand that? my father and your father. <clears throat> yeah, but those are the translators putting it there. It's not in a... Ah, um, the translators. Uh -huh. mm. You are playing games. Okay, I'm playing games. Okay, let us see. What about this hadith? <clears throat> Let me try open YouTube one second. Can you still hear me? Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. What about this hadith here? Good, good. I'm opening YouTube right now. Okay, because open. I don't trust you. Or no, don't trust me. I don't trust myself, my brother. I ate too much uh, falafel. Falafel, yeah. yeah. Hummus. Yeah. Now answer. Does it say that your prophet is the one who says, "Verily, my father and your father in hellfire"? Yes. Yes. So why are you lying to me? Wrong. I was wrong, okay. I was wrong, um, okay. Asked, okay. <laughs> All right, now, so we go back to zero. Let me ask you. So, let you're me, a prophet, you're a prophet. His father no, 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 no. did not say, Inshallah, obviously, before he do boom, boom. 
So now, Listen. why Suleiman, his children became half a children when Suleiman is a believer and he want to even do jihad, he want to have kids so he can do kill Christians and Jews. So why Allah is giving him half a child just because he forgot to say inshallah, but you're a prophet father, he did not say inshallah at all, yet he gave him uh, half Muhammad. Let me ask you a question, okay? I answered the question now. You ask me, turn. you answer me nothing um, until now. I'm waiting for the first question. Why? This is the question. Why Allah did that to Suleiman, did not do that to Muhammad? Let, let, let me ask you a question, okay? Okay, uh, so you want to so just say it. I, I have no answer. Say, just say it. Say it, and I'll no, let no, you no, ask I, me the question. No, 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 no. I have then a, answer uh, me then. Don't, don't don't change topic. If you say I don't have an answer, I give up. Okay, no problem. Otherwise, answer, yeah. and you can ask me the question. I will explain to you. I will explain to no, you. No, answer the question. Don't explain. I don't want explanation. I want an answer. So why this has happened to Suleiman? He forgot to say inshallah. But there's millions of people don't say inshallah at all, including the father of Muhammad, and nothing happened to them. Go ahead. I don't know. To be honest, I think the Thank you. Finally, he said, I don't know. Now hit me with the question you have. So he do not know, guys. The guy who claimed he know, he know nothing. Okay, thank you for being honest at least. So now what is no, your no. question? I said I said I said I don't know who put the story there. Uh, you what know, do you mean who put I, the story there? Are you are you telling me are you was, are you going to say to me I wasn't there? Are you saying to me you wasn't there? Well you're a prophet is the one who said the story and this is authentic. The the story looks uh, fabricated. Ah but I showed you Quran. Okay, explain to me the Quran. No, 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 it no, says, no. Okay, show, uh, explain to me the Quran, no. chapter thirty eight, verse number twenty three. It says that this is my brother. He have 99 goats. Explain to me this verse. Who is the one is talking and who are they the goats? Here we go. This is Quran. Let me ask you something. No, don't ask me for something. Because I said to you, in order to ask me something, you have to admit that you are an ignorant. You have no answer. You, you see, you play the game that the hadith is weak. And it's not. We showed you it is sahih. Now we are showing you Quran. So chapter 38 verse number 23 it says my brother he have 99 wives I explained to you already they are I goats. huh I, I explained already what the word uh. the word for goat there uh -huh. Okay but what this story is about who is talking and what 99 what he's talking about what is what is about explain to me what is behind the story I told you the word, the word for wife mm -hmm. is uh, in Arabic mm -hmm. we say uh, zawaj Mm. It is not, uh, you know, there. Uh -huh. Do you see the word Zawaj there? Uh -huh. I don't see the word Zawaj. Mm. And well, what, is, yeah, what, is the an what is the answer? I'm asking you for the answer now. What this is behind? What is behind this story here? Do you see the word <laughs> Zawaj there? What Zawaj? No, it's not. Yeah, there. Yeah. No. So, so. Okay. So you tell me. I'm asking you. You yeah. don't tell me. So, so, so. You tell me. What is the meaning? Tell me the story. Go ahead. I don't, I don't know the story to be honest. Uh, so what, you what you are, so so admit that you do not know just say it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you do not know. Now, uh, so guys, finally he admit that he's ignorant. Now, give me your question. Go ahead. I uh, saw so you in many of your videos. You say uh, the word uh, Allah means uh, moon god. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, you say the word Al means. Uh, uh, in English, uh, the hmm. correct in Arabic, not in English. Oh, yes, in Arabic. Okay, yeah. um, it means the no, okay, it, it, ha it has two meanings. No, the word L, it has two meanings, which is I know, I know, don't teach me Arabic. I know Arabic better. No, you don't speak okay. Arabic. Okay, speak to me Arabic. Go ahead. You speak classic um, Arabic. I speak any, any Arabic you wish in the world. Go ahead, speak to me in Arabic. You don't speak, speak to me classical. Speak Arabic. to me no. in Arabic, any right? It's just a speak to me Arabic. Go ahead. Prove to me your point in Arabic. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, you don't know Arabic. Okay, so the word L. No, no, no. Al, speak to me in Arabic. Give me the answer in Arabic. Just to show everybody that you are a liar, you don't speak Arabic. Go ahead. Give me the answer in Arabic first and then say it in English. Go ahead. Uh, don't embarrass yourself in front of me, okay? Give Listen. me the answer in Arabic. Don't embarrass yourself, my friend. Give me the answer in Arabic. You know, the, in Arabic, okay, let me, let me explain, let me explain. No, no, don't give me the, me. you said you don't, speak Arabic. I said, don't embrace yourself in Arabic. Let's see who's going to be embraced. Give me the answer in Arabic, go ahead. You don't speak classical Arabic. Even give me the Arabic. answer in Arabic. You don't speak classical Arabic. My friend, you are, you are, people will see in a second. Okay, go no, ahead, let us see who no, speak, who don't no, speak. Go ahead, speak to me in the no, classical Arabic. Go ahead, give me the answer in the classical no, Arabic. You start, you claim you speak classical Arabic, you speak to me. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting. 
What do you mean speak? Okay. هذا المتحدث معي حمار ابن حمار وفي رأسه رسن. Here we go. I spoke to you in Arabic, and now I want you to prove is, me wrong. What is this? What is this, my friend? Is this is this classical Arabic? Yes. Translate what I said. Can you can you translate what I said? Oh my God. This classical Arabic. Yes. This is okay. I will, I will give you. Okay. Hold on, guys. This guy. This guy. Yes. He don't. He don't. He don't agree that the, I said uh, classical Arabic. Okay. I will this say to you. Okay, oh. I will say to you. Listen, listen, listen. Hold, no, no, on, ask, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, well, that you are doing a lada hunna haulaini kamilain. Is that a classical Arabic or not? Uh, that, uh, try, 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 try not to fart. Try not to fart. Oh, you said this is for this is Quran. You eat it. I was reading Quran for you. This is Quran. Here we go. This is the chapter two, verse number two, three, three. I was reading Quran for you, and you said try not to fart. Hey, everybody heard you. You're scared. See, you're scared. I everybody heard you. I was reading Quran in the classical Arabic. Well, well, that you are born, or let the hunna haulain a kamilain, and you said to me, "Don't fart." My friend, you you're not Arab. Listen, let me, <laughs> let, let let me let me ask you my question. Just, okay, don't be scared. Just okay, let, just, don't just get lost. Get lost. We spanked you as as enough. You don't speak Arabic. Eh? An, an Indonesian guy is telling me to me you don't speak Arabic. <laughs> Why are you hang up to my face? Because you are stupid. Okay, are you going to speak to me in Arabic or not? I challenge you to speak to me in Arabic. Why Go you ahead. hang up to my face? Speak in Arabic. Otherwise, don't waste my time. I want to speak to you in Arabic only. Classical right, language. Go ahead. I don't hear you for somebody. S listen. Oh. What? Why you hang up? What? Don't go. Don't go. <laughs> Speak Why to me. Give me the answer in Arabic, please. Can you still be scared? Give me the answer in Arabic. You claim that you please. speak Arabic. You are a liar. You don't speak Arabic. And you accuse me that I am reading Quran and you call it fart. Shame on you. You called the Quran fart. You How dare you? How dare you? you I was reading the Quran. I was reading the Quran, chapter 2, verse friend, number 2. My friend, you speak. Don't tell me your friend. I'm asking you. Did I read the Quran for you and you said stop farting? I was no, reading the I Quran was, for you, was, chapter 2, I verse was, number 233. So, why you said stop farting? You, I was referring to the um, things you said before. Ah, before. No, you said the word farting after I did read this. Listen. Mm. Let me ask you something. Ask, me, ask me something. something. Okay, so, okay, so, so the word you said, you said the word, don't be scared. <laughs> Let me ask my question, okay? Okay. Because you said you cannot refute me. You said <laughs> the word um, Allah means Al means the, and Allah uh, is the name of the moon god, correct? Uh huh, yeah. Okay. If my name is uh, Theodore, does that mean that my name is uh, Od Odor? Mm, you understand me? You are very smart. Yeah, Abdul, I'll type. Okay, you said you speak Arabic, right? Can you read for me this word in the in the in the in the screen? I don't see. I don't. See, I don't. So okay. if my name read is read for this, me, read for me. Hold on, read for me. The second word, the second name of Allah in the Quran. The second name. The second oh, time. Man. The second time the word Allah mentioned in the Quran, verse number two in chapter number one. And verse number one, chapter number one. What the difference between them? It. What the difference between them? Uh, the Aleph, the Aleph. Uh, okay, why uh, the Aleph is missing? Oh my God, you want, okay, let me teach you Arabic, okay? Okay, teach me Arabic. In, in Arabic language for the grammar, mm. the word Al mm. means the, okay? The. It is, okay. Uh, it's, yeah. So guys, it the is. word Al means that, so thank you very much. So the word that, let us type it there yes. so you don't change your mind later. So if we oh, say here, the, so the first word Allah, when you say in the name of Allah, you are saying the, la. Mm. The, la. Thank you. Listen, you, look, you look, just look, to prove look, my point. Look, look. So Allah, your God name is not Allah. Your God name is la. Yo, see, 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 look, <laughs> look in the chat, look in the chat, everybody, look, my if, friend, if my name is, I, I want to answer, Theodore. no, this is, this is, this is a name of God, what Theodore, what Theodore, are you stupid or what, this is Arabic, and now I want you to answer, you just admit it, that the, the first two letters in, in the, the name of your look God, you just admit it, everybody heard you, that the first the two chat. letters, the first two letters in the name of your God, according to you, is that, 
You said that, not me. The la. So what the name of your God? We don't understand. We don't no, understand. you said that, not me. I'm just going with you. I'm just going with you. You are the one who said to me, do you know what the first two letters? You said, yes, the first is the. the. This is the, the, I said to you, why in, in the Allah, in the second verse, this appeared the Aleph? I said, what the difference between them? You said to me, the Aleph. Okay, I said, so why? You said, because the first two letters in the first one is the, equal to the. So the name of your God is La. And what is La? We can search right now in Google. We'll find that La is the moon God. See, 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 see how stupid you are. See, well, I am stupid. If I am a stupid, you teach me, isn't you who says to me, yeah. The name of your God is you, the Allah? You're not letting me talk. You're not letting me talk. <laughs> you're not letting me talk. The second one, okay. In the second one, why the elf disappear? What we have, it says, Li la. Do you agree with that? Alhamdulillah. Do you agree with that? Are, are you letting me talk? Or I'm asking, yes, talk? you are, you are talking. I'm asking to you. Number two, Allah number two. Does it say Lila? Lila? Do you agree with that or I'm lying? You you are um, putting words. Do you in my agree? Mouth. No, you said that it's recorded. But Everybody will laugh no, at you. It no, is no, recorded. No. You cannot say you did not say that. So when you say li, 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 la, li, la, li la, what the word li mean? What the letter li mean? Li la. What li mean? As long you claim you speak Arabic. You're not letting me talk. I'm asking you, what's wrong with you? What li mean? Li la. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Rabbil alameen. It's okay. So what li mean? Isma Hamar. Isma Hamar. Listen. He's calling me donkey uh, now. By the way, Abdul, you don't say Hamar. You say Himar. Yeah, Himar. Don't call me Hamar. Yes, yes. Himar. Yes, yes. Okay. So let, yes, let, let yes. me ask you, as long as you are calling me Himar, friend, speak, don't you know, don't Arabic you know that your prophet wife, her father is his name is Jash? What Jash mean? It's mean donkey. So you're a prophet, he married from a woman, her last name is Donkey. And not only that, your grandfather, the prophet name is Kilab, which means dogs. So you're a prophet, is a son of dogs and married to the sons of uh, donkeys. So why you are calling me names of animals? No, answer. Lila, who is speak, Lee and what is La? You speak, you speak Lebanese Arabic. You know, that's not Arabic. Abdul, that's Abdul. Little, little Arabic, little 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 answer me. Lila, who is Lee and who is La? What Lee mean and what La mean? If my name is uh, Theodore, does that mean that uh, my name is Odor? Uh, your name... You, you, you're playing, you're playing you, games. Your name, name is the back Theodore. door. Your name is the back but door. Now name, answer, don't name, change the topic. This is the Arabic. This is the name of your God. La, li, la. What li mean and who is la? Okay, let's go to the Bible. In the first verse of the Genesis, <laughs> it, says, it says, listen, see, you're going to hang up on me. Huh? You're going to hang up on me. Yes, now. I will and hang up scared. on you because you are a you're coward. Scared. You are, you are no, you're away. Scared. I'm asking you, why you don't want to well, answer? She, you are I the one who chose no the people. question. You are the one who chose the topic. You said to me, I want to ask you something. I want to ask you something. I want to ask you something. And finally, I said, okay, ask me something. You said to me, you said, you said that the Allah is the moon God. Why you are changing topic now? Isn't it, isn't it you who chose this topic? Tell okay. me what does that mean? My, no, God's il, il is mean God. Il, il. Hold on, hold on. Thank you for saying that. Let me ask you. In the Quran, it says that there's an angel. His name is Jibreel. What uh -huh. is the last two letters of Jibreel? Bereshit bara Elohim. I'm asking you, so, what is the last two letters of Jibreel? Jibra'il. Il okay. is the word mean God. Uh -huh. your, your false prophet, he stole the word you do not know, that Jibra'il is not a name. It's a sentence. Now, if I ask you what the word Jibreel mean, what you will say? In the Hebrew, in the Hebrew. I'm Bible, asking you, uh, what Jibra'il mean? In the Hebrew my friend, I'm explaining. Let me explain. Mm. In the Hebrew Bible, it says Gabriel, not Jibril. No Jibril problem. This is in English. Okay, I'm asking you in the Arabic, in the Arabic, you, in your Quran, what Jibril mean? Jibril, uh, we don't know. We don't know the name. You know what Jibril? What do you know? You? So are you saying to me, you Muslims, you stole the name from the Jews, but you do not know what this mean? It's the Arabic way of the name Gabriel. I'm asking you. So no problem. The Arabic way. So what is the Jibril mean? Uh, we don't know ah, uh, because mm, you mm, are following an ignorant stupid prophet uh, because well, how in the world how, okay what Ishmael mean Ishmael 
uh, the one who struggle with God. Ishmael mean the one who struggle with God. Okay, wait, um, who taught you that? Uh, it's, uh, uh, that's what um, I've read. I'm asking you who taught you that? Where? Where you read that? Where? Wait, 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 wait. You talking about uh, Ishmael? Uh, or, uh, Ishmael, uh, yes, Ishmael. What Ishmael mean? Um, uh, God will uh, hear. Okay. So where is the word God in the word Ishmael? That no, that's the transliteration in uh, Hebrew. Abdul, in don't Hebrew, you, Abdul, where is the word God in the word Ishmael? Where is the word God in the word Ishmael? In Arabic. I am in asking Arabic. you in Arabic. In no. Ar I don't care. Where is the can word God? Where is the word God in Arabic? In the word Jibril? No problem. Jibril in Arabic. I will, I will, okay. Where I will is the word God? Where, where we can find the word God? I will answer. Can, huh. can I answer? Yes, sure, sure. There, okay, you are trying to mix Hebrew with Arabic. It I am not. I am not. You said to me Jibril is an Arabic, Arabic word. So I'm asking you. I'm yes. asking you, Abdul. Stop being a stop being a kid. I want you to be a man for one time in your life. You said Jibreel in Arabic, so I'm saying to you, Jibreel in Arabic, where is the word God? You are the one who says that there is the word God there. Which part of the word Jibreel or Ishmael is the word God? Are you finished? Waiting for the answer. It's, it's okay, in Hebrew. Don't tell word. me in Hebrew. I'm asking you, where is the word God in the Arabic Jibreel? Which don't is we, we, what is the word God in the and you said to me Jibril name include the word God I did, that I didn't say Jibril, I said Gabriel, not Jibril. Gabriel, Gabriel, okay, in Arabic, in Arabic, Jibril. When we say Jibril in Arabic, the Quran, the Quran, when say the word Jibril, Jibril, where is the word God? What the word Jibril mean? If you're not letting me talk, I cannot talk. Listen. In, in Hebrew, okay, it, it means... I uh, don't want in Hebrew. Stop playing a yeah, game. I, you are dumb like your prophet. I'm asking you, what is the name Jibreel mean in Arabic? You do not know. Okay, relax. you told me You told me about really, Ishmael. Really. Okay, hold on. Ishmael, really, forget really, about Jibreel. Relax, relax. No, hey, no, relax. no, no, no. I'm, I'm laughing. We are laughing. We are laughing at the stupidity. You, you're going you to have heart attack. No, relax, the relax. one who have heart attack is your prophet and he died from poison. He's already dead. I'm alive. And here we go. Stop. You cannot hey. answer me. All of you, 1.4 billion Muslims, none of you knows what Jibreel mean. This is because your prophet is a thief. It means God will hear. It's mean, it mean what? God will hear. God will hear. Guys, God will hear Jibreel. Mm -hmm. This is the meaning of Jibreel. Mm -hmm. This is the meaning of Jibreel. This is the meaning of Jibreel. This is the meaning of Jibreel. God will hear. Where do you get this from? Look, in, okay, look, in, in Hebrew, the word Ishmael, Shema, Shama, Shama means to hear. Get and lost, hear. stupid. It means God. Get lost, stupid idiot, donkey. I give you time more than you deserve. You just prove to us that your God, Allah, is the moon God. Zalah, that's your word, not my words. However, the AL, it means the in Arabic, yes. But in the ancient Aramaic, Al is equal to the word God. So each time you say the, lillah, li here is two. This li here is equal to two, the letter two. So we type here the word two. This is what the word mean. L is equal to two. Two la. Let us make it in different colors so people can recognize better. So this letter la, sorry, L is equal to. What is the name after that? It is la. That is the name of your God. La. In here, the is equal to Al, which is the word God. And this is in the ancient Hebrew and the ancient Aramaic. So even in Hebrew, the word Al was God, and then it became Il. So Israel, it was Israel. Ishmael, it was Ishmael. Gabriel was Gabriel. In the new Hebrew, the letter Al, 
who which is equal to God it's not a name it's just a word being God is transformed into eel so we say Jesus is Emmanuel he is God with us and this is what happened when you have a thief who copy names but he do not know what those names mean the same we find with the fool Muhammad if we go to chapter 36 in the Quran we find that Muhammad is quoting his God as seen yeah seen what Yasin? Who is Yasin? Look at the name of the verse. You can change to any translation. You will find that the Muslims, they have no idea what this is mean. What Yasin? Yasin. Ya is a word equal to God. It's not a name of God. It's a word equal to God. Generic word for God. But this is in the Aramaic language. Sin is the moon god and this is why the muslim they could not translate it because nobody knows what is that you go to the interpretation everyone he is guessing some they say this is aramaic and we do not know what allah mean by that but yasin or yasin is a word mean god seen god which is the god of the moon and those who they are christians who used to worship sin when they were pagan they use the word sin today when they translate something as equal to sin so they say this is sin this is pagan this is sin this is sin so your god one of his name is sin do you see it stupidity Muhammad he collect names he put them in the Quran and more proof of the collection of the of names as an example the Quran says that the father of Abraham is Azar ask any Muslim what is the name of your father of Abraham he will say to you Azar the Quran says that <laughs> the stupid author of the Quran he thought Azar is a word mean, or it's a word which is a name, but the fact it's not. It's a word mean a fool. So Abraham, he said to his father, Azar, foolish. Are you going to worship idols? The stupid Muhammad, he thought that the word Azar is the name of the father of Abraham. But all of us, we can go right now. It take you two seconds to, to, to search. What is the name of the father of Abraham in a prophet? Google peace upon him. And you will find that there's nobody ever mentioned such a name. But the fool Muhammad, he thought the word fool is the name of the father of Abraham. Have you ever, an Aramaic person, he will call his, his, his son fool? And now the Muslim, they think that Azar is the name of the father of Abraham. But this is a word mean fool. Muhammad, he copied from the one who was translating from the gospel and from the Torah, which his name is Waraq ibn Nufal. And the hadith referred to that clearly in Sahih hadith. So Muhammad, he heard him saying that Abraham, he said to his father, Azar. Muhammad, he thought that Azar is the name of the father. But in fact, he was saying to him, father. Foolish father, you should not worship idols. Makes sense, right? That makes sense. This is foolish father. You should not worship idols as God. And this is what happened when you follow a thief like Muhammad, who do not know what he is talking about. And this is why they do not know what Jibreel mean, what Ishmael mean, what Israel mean, what Mikael mean, what Israel, all those names, Muhammad, he copied from the Jews, and he have no idea. What Abraham mean, they don't know. What Isa mean, they do not know. They don't know. What Moses mean, they don't know. For it is a theft religion. Can you show us reference? Yeah, this, you know, you can go and ask anyone who studied the ancient Aramaic, and he will show you. Azar is a fool, foolish. It's not a secret. Actually, even in your Islamic interpretation, later they notice the Christian, they start laughing at them. And they said, Azar is not the name of the father of, Muhammad, uh, of Abraham. There's many Islamic scholars that discover that this is stupid, but it's too late.
Any Muslim? Did we have a good time, guys? The funny an Indonesian guy who say he do not know how to say two. Even this guy who don't speak two Arabic words together, he is he is he's going to challenge me in Arabic. <laughs> By the way, I, I want to tell you something. I just order a lot of a glue from Amazon.com because each time Muslims, they, each time I go online, the Muslim they destroy me, and I spend the day after that trying to glue myself together. So don't forget. Thank you for your donation because we are using it for a glue. If you wonder where the donation is going, it's for a glue, brother. Do you see what happened? I wish I can show you my face now. I have a lot of dark spots in my face right now from the beating of this guy. This guy was beating me all over. Unbelievable. Stupid cult. So, I hope that we have a good time. Uh, this, uh, this video will disappear for uh, maybe an hour because we load it in different channel. But then always to find the videos which we just made today or the day before remember copy the title after two hours from now or three hours maximum search for the, the same title and filter to search for the last 24 hours and you will find the video all right very easy you know asal 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 jack and nahal ya tarik as salah you know asal the, the 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 brother he's saying to me asal asal which mean like in this is an egyptian uh, style they say like when somebody is doing great they say honey honey you know so i'm saying to him don't say honey there's a lot of bees around if i show you from my windows what i have you will be scared even though it's very cold i don't know how the bees can live until now it's a freezing outside unbelievable all right <clears throat> uh no we are going to use the quality of life uh you know I will I will make a video there soon, but you have to give me an idea topic to talk about it All right And we are posting here videos have nothing to do with Islam too because we don't want to keep our channel empty You know because we don't keep here anything as you know, yeah, YouTube they target us what we can do All right, my friend remember carefully we are you see the reason we are sure of a victory Not because you have a Christian Prince Christian Prince is no one Victory always come from the Lord the one who stand with the truth. He will never be defeated The Lord he said they can kill your body What is the benefit of a man he can win the whole world, but he lost his soul So the winning we do we win souls is not about the body. It's not about the land It's not about money. It's not about a, a, a Government we don't care for those things because everything will be demolished and Everything will go the Lord, he says, everything will perish except my words. Will not. So the word of the Lord is going to defeat every cult exists in this earth. Not only the cult of Muhammad the thief. And the Christian prince is nothing but just a person transferring knowledge which you don't have. Because let us say, God, he, he helped me to speak Arabic. God, he gave me the gift to know, to recognize, to be able to, to connect the dots together. And God, he gave me a gift which is called the brain. Thank you, Lord, for what I have. So everything I have is a gift from my Lord, nothing of my own. And by him, we are victorious. And this is why when we go live on air, we say we challenge anyone to call us. We don't know who's going to call. And we don't care who will call. Because it doesn't matter who call, he is going to be in trouble and he will face an extreme humiliation of ignorance and stupidity. Not only because he is a fool, but because he is following a fool. And this is what happened to you when you are a fool following a fool. If the best example of you is a fool, so what do you expect from those who follow a fool? When the Quran says the sun set in the murky water, and then we show them Muhammad saying that, explaining that, not only the Quran saying that, how you follow a fool, how you can do so. Uh, it is stupid. This is logic. We talk about Allah. He's talking about Theodore. What Theodore have to do with my? <laughs> we are talking about ancient language. What Theodore have to do with our topic? This is stupid. 
So we are showing what those letters who they are in the beginning, they are not part of the name. This is why in the first verses in the Quran, one it says Allah, the second verse says Lillah, because simply it's not a name, the first two letters. It's not part of the name. That's why you can take them off. When I say the Christ, that is not part of the name. But I cannot take any letters out of the Christ as a Christ. But that I can say. I can say Christ said to me. But I can say the Christ. But Christ do not need that because he is the only one. There's no other Christ. And this is why, even in Arabic, it says Al-Masih. Al-Masih. Al is added before names which is not to be in competition with any. وَقَوْلَهُمْ إِنَّا قَتَلْنَا الْمَسِيحِ Why he is Al-Masih? Because there's only one Messiah and divine to be the only one. There's many Muhammad, there's many Isa, but there's only one Christ. And this is why Muslims are not allowed to give a name to any child of their own as Al-Masih. If somebody claim to be or call himself Al-Masih, the Muslims will kill him immediately. But you can call yourself Muhammad. Because the Messiah is the Lord and nobody earn his name. Even in your stupid cult. The name of the Messiah, my friend, in Arabic, in English, in Hebrew, it doesn't matter. The second you say it, a human being, his body is in trouble. He is like an electric shot. And this is how the Muslims even feel when they say the word al Messiah. It's a very powerful name. It doesn't matter who is the one reading the name. The second you say the Messiah, you are, you feel something different. And maybe many people do not know. There's a lot of churches in the Middle East sponsored by the donation of Muslims for the sake of Al-Masih because they knew Muhammad have no healing. Anyone have a problem from the Muslims believe. He go to the Messiah asking for help. He don't go to Muhammad. Muhammad, he died because of a poison and Allah, neither him, could not save him. Very slow death. That is Muhammad. And this story here raised many questions. If Muhammad is the most beloved prophet for Allah, as Muslims they claim, so why Allah, he saved Isa, but he did not save Muhammad? The truth is ugly, my friend. And the Muslims cannot handle the truth. Right? That is the truth. Anyway, I want to say thank you all for being here. Remember, this video will disappear from my channel for two, three hours. Again, after three hours, search for how to approach a Muslim and save him from Islam. Search it a few hours from now, and you will have the video posted again in different channels. Until, until we go again live on air, if the Lord wants us to do so, I say may the Lord bless you all. And if you like to learn more about Islam, you can read my books. And I have now more translation posted. We have six and Allah in Spanish. And, uh, uh, you know, we have six and Allah in Dutch. We have six and Allah in German. All of those, uh, they are up and in Amazon in the last uh, seven days only. So I'm glad for those who help us for the translation. So many people from many languages can read and they can learn. Thank you. May the, Lord, may the Lord bless you all. And until I see you again, Christ is Lord. Islam is false. And we prove it every day. And as Muhammad, he said, as a Jew, he said to Muhammad, this is how we do it. Thank you.